Tensions are escalating as an activist calls for the separation of Barotseland from Zambia. Now, let's hear directly from the activist who has been at the forefront of this demand for separation. Since we declared ourselves to be independent after the DNC meeting in Mungu, it appears the Iranian government has not taken any serious steps to follow our demands. We told them clearly that Barozeland and Zambia should separate and we want to go on our own. They have been talking about development. We don't need development from Zambia. We want to develop ourselves as an independent country. The demand has sparked a response from President Hakend Hichelima, who addressed the issue during a meeting with permanent secretaries, controlling officers, and senior government officials. In a firm response, President Hichelima declared that there is no entity called Barotseland within Zambia. He directed Western Province Permanent Secretary Simomo Akapelua to convey the message to the people in the region, emphasizing that Zambia is a unitary state. P.S. Akapelua. You don't have a country called Western Province. Barosland, there's nothing like that. It's a unitary state. I'm serious. It's a unitary state. You, where you sit, you must remind yourself and the people that we are one Zambia, one nation, one people. One Zambia, one nation. Can you speak loudly? One Zambia, one nation. In reaction to the president's remarks, Baratsela Nationalist Youth issue a warning to President Hichelima. Let's hear their response. We, the offsprings of those who possessed Barosland Kingdom, are gathered here today to respond to Mr. Hakainde Hichilema's statement he made on 18th January 2024. In his statement, he said that, one, there is no country called Western Province of Barosland. Two, he further said that Zambia is a unitary state. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First and for almost we want to advise Mr. Sami Hichlema to humble himself. He is not God. He speaks like some people who used to say that Hakainde will never be a president of Zambia. But today he is. May God forgive Sami Hichlema because he doesn't know what he is doing. Barosland is our inheritance and not Zambia. Mr. Hakainde Hichlema should just concentrate on reducing the price of millennial to 50 kwacha, which he used to champion during his campaign promises. What Mr. Hakainde Chilema should know is that Barosland existed as an independent territory before 1964. To say that Barosland Kingdom does not exist is cheap politics. Is Mr. Hakainde telling us that His Royal Highness Chitimukuru Kanyanta Manga II of the Bemba speaking people was dreaming when he addressed the Litunga of Barosland as King of Barosland and not Western Province. The statement by Mr. Hakainde Ichilema clearly shows that he is on a serious move of colonizing and destroying Barosland Kingdom. That Meanwhile, Jackson Silavui, president of the GPZ party, expresses his support for President Hichilema's stance on maintaining Zambia as a unitary state. Well, I wish to make it uh, very clear that I wish to un uh, reservedly support President Akainde Ichilema on this pronouncement regarding Zambia remaining a unitary state. Any person, and I want to encourage the Republican president, and any person agitating for the cessation of any part of our country must be dealt with as the law prescribes. The Republican president has the full backing of the Golden Party of Zambia on this matter to the latter i thank you and the mbunda royal establishment in kaoma has made a clear stance against separatist sentiments in western province in a statement released today they declared that as an ethnic group in the province they have no interest in the current secessionist discussions and wholeheartedly support president hakind hichilima's position this issue is clearly stirring strong sentiments on both sides
we will continue to monitor developments and bring you the latest updates. Katendi Moya. Revelation News.